hey guys welcome back to my channel my video today is all about mastering your skill and um, i've talked about this in different ways before but i just thought i'd make a small video and um, talking through some of the steps that i think you should that should help you towards mastering your skill my first tip is grab a doll head it's probably going to be one of the most important um things that you have right using your doll head to basically practice cuts or whatever it is you're trying to master if it's wigs if it's plaiting if it's cane rows if it's um crochet whatever it may be grab a doll head and practice on them first the second tip is really easy um use your family and friends um the people around you are going to be your great assets they're going to be the people that are going to support you and they're going to be the people that will basically have to do what you want them to do and um, let them know obviously that you're practicing and just practice on them they will be more forgiving and they will also give you harsh truths about your skill and family and friends i always find um don't hold back on how they feel about certain things and so you're most likely going to get a more critical um review from them than you are from clients because because sometimes clients out of being you know polite or maybe even out of place and just out of not wanting to put you out may butter some things for you but your family and friends will always be 100 with you so they will tell you if you're really rubbish and they will tell you if it was really good and they will tell you if you're getting better so they are actually um the best people to practice on go to classes to strengthen your skill um in the world of hairdressing there is no way you can't do something or there is there is always a class for something basically you'll be able to find a class everywhere and anywhere and even if you're not um there's always someone that knows how to do something better than you so maybe even just go and shadow someone so you can learn the skill a little bit better and this last tip is something that i took personally take pictures of your work so that you can see your own progress and film your work and put it on something like YouTube so you can see your work and you can see your progress. That's how I started and it's been a dream come true. So I hope these tips helped and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.